ladies and gentlemen. Pokemon Go is officially taking over the world. Now you may be like, what are you on about? What is this dickhead on about, right? But I'll tell you what, I'll tell you what, it is taking over. Went straight from Call of Duty content, Pokemon Go. What is this? And then there's even people showing how you can download it when it's not even out. Like, have a look at this. And it's come to the serious point, boys, 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 listen to this. Where people, people are jumping into. Well, not jumping into, right? Okay, okay, I got messed up there. They're just slipping the ponds. Just like that. On live streams. On live stream as well. I mean, just have a look at this. There's a lure up here, though, I think. Yeah, there's yeah. someone on the bridge. There's someone on the bridge? Yeah, I heard him talking. I'm probably gonna go check that out. Wait, how do I even get up there? Wow. Holy shit, I didn't know that was water. <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> Pokemon Go. <laughs> Holy shit, I did not realize that was water. I know, you got me, dude. I mean, but then, look at this. I mean, this just completely officially supports my opinion. When you have to low-key catch one while your wife is about to give birth, and then, you know, there's just um, a dirty uh, Pidgey. I mean, but Pidgeys, Pidgeys, they're like the most rarest thing ever. And then there's this, lads, there's, there's this. When you find yourself literally taking Pokemon away from children, as this title is right here, and um, I don't know if I should read this, but let's go ahead. MMG, the sweetest thing just happened. I'm sitting here watching Netflix when all of a sudden I hear two cute little knocks at my front door. A boy and a girl, like 12, asked, what's up? I mean, the first thing you'd probably say is, why the fuck are you in my front door? But you know, excuse me, sir, but there's a Pikachu in your backyard and my sister and I were wondering if I can go in and catch it. I look down and these two young Pokemon trainers, I see myself in the little boy, so I slam through my door and run to the backyard. Guess who has the Pikachu, bitches? Well, of course. Uh, her, I guess. Or maybe uh, the little kids just jumped over the back garden, you know, because they're rebels. Uh, and then there's this here. Tweeted out by uh, some Alex Hiss. Uh, he's a verified account. I guess I guess someone knows who he is, I guess. So, um, real talk, though. Why is this Jigglypuff leading me to this unmarked white van? I mean, is it meant to be marked? He's saying that, like, it should have been marked by, like, some, you know, like, official agency or something. Like, it's meant to be saying, you know, Pokemon pedophiles here or something. I don't know. I have no f***ing idea. And then there's, uh, there's this image, yeah, which is titled... When you're finally able to impress your doctor. One month after playing Pokemon Go. Doctor, do you exercise? Me, I play Pokemon Go. Writes on notepad. Fate. AF. 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 Ash. Fuck, mate. But then, ladies and gentlemen, I mean Pokemon Go. It's like the new uh, Bloods vs. Crips vs. Uh, bananas in Pajamas. <laughs> Have a look at this article right here. Pokemon Go used to lure innocent victims into a trap. Cops claim. I mean, you see this article here. I mean, you see there's the, there's these things happening. You know, there's always something happening in the world where someone will get robbed. But then Pokemon Go is slapped with the label. If it's something Pokemon Go, it, it'll be it'll be widespread news. You know. But if it's not, then it's just just another robbery or occurrence that really won't be publicized. Other news here. Nine nine nine. Call for Pikachu. Now I'm first gonna play this out, and then you know. I'm gonna listen to it myself. No, I did listen to it, but I'm gonna go through the steps again, you know, just look at it into it in depth, even though it is like, what, 22 seconds long. And uh, you might wanna turn down the volume for this. So let me let you guys listen to this, and then I'm gonna go do a little review of it after. Nine, nine, nine. <laughs> it's calling again. Uh, somebody stole my Pokemon. Right, why is that a nine, nine, nine call? Because it's really bad. Like, I was trying to get realize, a Pikachu. You do realise that you're stopping someone with a life or death emergency about a Pokemon. I straight off at the beginning, I mean, if that didn't get you deaf, then I don't know what that was. Someone jiggling the um, cowbell or something. Oh, boys, boys. It's, it's really bad. It's a Pikachu. I mean, you can't really steal Pokemon. I mean, that's the thing, right? If you, if you think you can steal a Pokemon, if it's, it's, it's there for literally a few minutes, 
if you don't capture it and if someone else does capture it it's still there for you there is no way you can fucking uh get uh, put a pikachu stolen away from you so this is complete bollocks straight off the bat and then i guess after he says you're stopping a life and or death emergency then uh he just i guess he just puts the phone down he's like you know shit shit the roses are fucking gonna come to my door fucking hell fucking five oh <laughs> there's then this there's this a driver a driver has crashed playing pokemon go and there's also uh, a death that has also happened uh, you know from someone playing pokemon go now once again this could just be uh you know a, it's just a, a death you know someone could be guessed uh, tons of people get literally you know stabbed robbed um killed and then if it's pokemon go related it's just a widespread news and I, I don't understand but otherwise if it doesn't have pokemon go related into it they'll just be like right why, why are we publicizing this because if it's pokemon go we're gonna publicize it man. i mean as you can see here teenager shot dead while searching for creatures in pokemon go it says here jerson lopez de leon who was 18 was ambushed and died after being shot while he was playing the game with cousin daniel right okay well um and it says oh okay 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 i understand this why why the two were walking alongside a railway line when they were shot at right okay a railway line i feel like this will be like in the middle of nowhere i mean whatever you do ladies and gentlemen pokemon go players out there just don't go anywhere near any railway lines i mean that's just certain now i mean nah nah don't allow that all right okay so there's two articles here in this one it says he was shot dead while ambushed while on the railway line and then this other article says he broke into a house to capture a pokemon R right and then he was shot right can can we actually get some legitimate uh, news here i guess not okay now but no screw that okay now the second the second best thing you know the second last thing i'm gonna leave to last the driver the driver playing pokemon go i mean you guys have probably seen this but i'm gonna play it first for you guys in case you guys haven't on july 18 2016 at approximately 3 30 a.m officers from our southeast district had just finished a call for service in the 2900 block of eastern avenue suddenly a toyota rav4 struck one of the patrol cars that was parked at the location the crash was captured on an officer's body-worn camera. Fortunately, the officer was not inside of his patrol car, and none of the occupants inside of the other vehicle were injured. The driver of the RAV4 told investigators that he was looking down, playing the Pokemon Go game, when he struck the patrol car. Hey, hey, my part. My part patrol car. 10 4 m 3 one Hey, I'm to respond to this location. 10 4 2 animal 9 you guys okay? You okay? Okay. What's the location? Twenty nine hundred one Eastern Avenue. And uh, were you in the vehicle, sir? You okay? Were you okay? I'm so sorry. No, nobody was in the car. You guys okay? Right. Okay. So you've seen that. He just smashes right into the back of that 5 0 car. What's he in? Like a t Toyota Land Cruiser or something? Now, I believe this is America, boys. Now, uh, the first thing the cop says is, are, are you guys okay? Now, I believe this will probably be in Canada since these guys haven't been shot already through the window and uh, handcuffed. But uh, this is, I mean, the cops are being really nice here. I mean, you know, I mean, the cops aren't being, you know, the typical stereotypes that they're being given always. And then the first thing this guy says, comes out of the car, that's what I get for playing this dumbass game. But he doesn't he doesn't say which game though. No. He doesn't say which game. So he's kinda of left that anonymous. Be playing Angry Birds, you know, and then just bang, he gets it. <laughs> Best to last, ladies and gentlemen. These people that actually go kind of the extra mile as I would say, and they go to literally Area 51. Yes, the heavily, you know, guarded base and the most heavily guarded, I'd say, place in the world. They come here, and at this point, I'm just going to play a little bit, and they actually get Pikachu at, like, the back gate of Area 51, as I'll just play this clip right now. Okay, so, it looks like Area 51's got a nice little Pikachu for us. Don't glitch up on me now. There we go. Okay. Is he going to load anything? Oh, don't freeze on me. Don't do this to me. Don't do this to me. You've got to be kidding me. Oh. I can't believe this. And then after this, you may be like, what, they get a Pikachu? Right, I'm packing my bags, you know, I'm nah, screw that. But then, they, they get Bulbasaur as well. I mean, they're getting, like, all the starter Pokemon. I mean, I'm packing my bags already here. Check it out, at Area 51, we got a little Bulbasaur. Let's get him. Cut, no. Come on. Okay, did we get him this time? We yeah. got him. Ha-ha! Ha-ha! 
I mean, that is basically it for the video. I mean, Pokemon Go basically taken over, but I guess in a kind of more good way, of course. So other than that, I hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you guys did, make sure to drop a like on this video. It'd be greatly appreciated. Subscribe if you are new. Hope you guys have a legendary day. Peace.